when, when they were kids, my, my, when my sons were kids, I told them a little bit about these experiences. I told them what I thought the children would understand and be interested in. And I told them I escaped from a German prison camp, which is, which is true and which is in the book. And they went to school and said, my mother escaped from a German prison camp. And the kids laughed and said, ha ha, maybe your father if he was in the army, but not your mother. So they came back and said, did you lie to us? I said, I didn't lie to you, it was, was correct. And so in some sense, this repeated itself many years later when I said, look, you know, I, I've written a successful book about my story. And then, okay, so you've written a successful book. People write books, everybody writes books, and we know because we know professors. And, uh, and then uh, last year, the city of Vienna has a program, which is a recommendable program. Once a year, they take one book and they print 100,000 copies of this and they give them away. They just practically on the street corners. They put them out in public libraries, they put them out in post offices and bookstores, you can go in and pick up your copy. And they did this to my book, and my son said, 100,000 copies, we have to come and see this. And there was a great uh, feast, and there was a sort of gala party, and the, the mayor of the city of Vienna was there. So he was very impressed, and I loved it. You know, you love to impress your children. You don't, you don't care as much to impress anybody else as your, uh, as your children, except maybe your doctoral advisor. You won't impress him because you need to get your PhD. But short of that, it's your kids whom you want to impress.